To Save Our UK, a charitable organisation in the UK that works primarily in Africa and India and helps rehabilitate people that have been hit by natural calamities and humanitarian tragedies. They work to build schools, healthcare facilities and lend a helping hand to propagate education. Sponsoring of 500 Abrar, that is audio, book, reader and recorder kits. The organization has also facilitated successful applications of the audiobook reading and audio recording, Abrar Apparatus, an innovative mechanism that can store material up to 240 hours. This device is easily accessible within seconds with the help of a braille keyboard. Partnering with Dr. Hedgevar Rugnalay and NCF in two cleft surgery camps. In the city of Aurangabad, Hope is alive and kicking for more than two decades. The Dr. Hedgwa Hospital, a landmark institute of charity and selfless service for the poor and the underprivileged. We started working on this camp uh, from the month of June. There were screening camps at various districts. Uh, to name a few, Bid, Buldana, Jalna and Parbhani. Every patient and their respective families are individually counselled to give them absolute clarity about the surgery. At the main ward, it seems like a whole new generation has taken a rebirth. Supporting Samvedana Latur in construction of new building. Samvedana is a unique project in this region of Marathwada, dealing with uh, physically and mentally handicapped infants and children.
finally construction of divya residential school at jawhar for special children touched by the plight of the children and inspired by this journey Save Our UK decided to step in to make a difference. And then began the journey of keeping this miracle alive and to seek miracle workers, a kind like you and me, who could step in and make this happen. Humongous effort has finally opened doors to usher in a new era for the school. Today, the new residential school foundation has been laid. Work has begun on a plan that is modern, equipped with green technology, will boast of international standards and set an example for special schools to come. But this is just the beginning, and if these children are to get a real shot at life. then many more will have to join hands to make this happen